like recently that few nights I got one of the nights uh, okay. I was bored then after I read something about Kumanta. Um, yeah, like what exactly is that, you know? Because like I read it's like something like children or what that mm-hmm. goes like for me I know it's just Toyo like the one to steal money mm-hmm. or like from the movies the green goblin <laughs> just green guy <laughs> run around steal money. So what exactly right is the Kumanton? Well, from what I know, right? Mm. Uh, maybe uh, in the uh, Malay black magic uh, concept, right? Yeah. Uh, they are here used for something uh, very bad, like very sinful, yeah. like stealing. Mm-hmm. And of course, uh, to disturb people. Yeah. Yeah. So uh, it's actually not very good. Yeah, like, of course. Of course. Uh, in Thai, right? We need to uh, know that Kuman uh, Tong doesn't equal to uh, Toyo. Mm. Okay? Once it's called Kuan Tong, right? Mm-hmm. It's not a so-called spirit anymore. So okay. once it's a Kuan Tong, it's not a spirit anymore. Uh, yeah, you can't really call a, call a Kuan Tong a, a Toyo or a spirit. Oh. Yeah. Why? Because uh, like like all the uh, Naman Prime and all the spirits, mm-hmm. they has been uh, recruited by all these uh, wizard monks, right? So uh, they actually bring them to their village, mm-hmm. and of course uh, the uh be in the mix uh, to, do the, to do all the uh, good stuff, mm-hmm. okay? Learn marriage for themselves and be mm-hmm. Same concept. And they are also uh, controlled by uh, all the, uh, I would say, the uh, wisdom monks and also uh, all the uh, wisdom ladies and all that. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So uh, they actually uh, so called have a contract with the uh, monks or the debtor itself, you know. And you know, uh, if we make you into a uh, so called the uh, statue of yeah. or the uh, amulets to block to actually uh, to help people. So people rent those amulets, mm-hmm. those uh, statues, right, at home and uh, they help them with the business in a good way. Oh. So they, how they do it is actually quite different to, from those uh, to you. Okay? So they attract business uh, for the uh, business owner and uh, they don't uh, blind people uh, from like. Uh, for example, like you know Toyo, right? Mm-hmm. You can use it to find people, like right? so that the person, like, uh, they, they, they can only see that uh, your store is open. Mm. Yeah, so that is actually a bad way of doing it. Mm-hmm. Yeah, so for Kuan Tong, they just attract uh, more customers for you. So it's like for luck, uh, bring, yeah, bring, bring in more customer more, wealth, yes. like this stuff. So yeah. compared to like the Toyo, which they are usually known to do bad things, like yes. stealing and like you know, blinding people, yes, uh, leaving them like all those, like covering their eyes, like, yeah. basically. Oh. Yeah, so uh, for Toyo, right, they kind of like uh, control your thinking. Uh, so called controlling your thinking. So yeah. like, to make you think like uh, this store is the best and everything. And uh, they will use whatever ways to like uh, convince, so called convince you uh, to uh, go to that particular store. Yeah, so while uh, for all these, uh, I would say, uh, white wheat craft for Mantong, right? Mm-hmm. Uh, they attract you, they get your attention. But of course, that, uh, if you still prefer like store B, right? Yeah. You still go to store B. Oh, yeah. So it's not like, uh, like you know, they play with your mind, one. Like, yes, they like, play with your mind. If you mind. still really like that shop, they will still go, you will yes. still go, like, you won't like cover your eyes and say, oh, suddenly I see the shop close yeah. like that. No, like, you won't do this no stuff. Such thing. Yeah. In those uh, white red craft in, uh, in Thai, right? Mm. Yeah, there's no, they don't use space for such a uh, simple act. So for like the Thai witchcraft, no simple apps like this Yes. Like. Yeah, yeah, they just get attention and increase the chance of you getting more business. Yeah. Okay. So you are actually not forced to that store, but rather attracted to it. Mm. Yeah. Okay. Then like, because like the thing is like, all those people, but there is there like still black magic way of doing it like that? In Thai, that right? right? Is yes, it? there is. Uh, of course, uh, many people uh, see in those movies, right? Yeah. They just feel blood, right? Yeah. I have seen people, uh, you know, they done that. Mm-hmm. Okay. But that's actually not very good. It's not the right way, lah. Like, yes. That's the thing. And those kind of toyo, right? In what I know, right? In Thai, right? Mm. Uh, you don't really call them Kuan Tong. Yeah. Kuan mm. Tong is a name for something, uh, like, for a child's reader, it's like so called more holy. Mm. Yeah. And uh, they are not Toyo. They are actually a uh, different, uh, so called different entity. Uh. Yeah, la, yeah, la. of course, like, it's a different thing already uh, yes. compared to a Toyo. The one that's like can be used for good. Toyo is, I, I don't think that's a way to use it 
for good lah. Most likely is always for the bad yes. thing lah. So like th- there is a difference lah. Yeah. True lah. Yeah. Because you play with the unknown also. Yes. They are unpredictable yeah. kind of. And of course, uh, for black magic, right? Normally those master uh, yeah, are considered as bad also lah. And they don't care about your customer. Once the so called product is done, right? Yeah. They give it to you mm-hmm. and uh, they receive the money and that's it. So they're just there for the money and that's yes. the thing. Uh, they don't really care about the spirit yeah. or you. It's just as long as the product is done, right? They get the thing sold, yes. right? Then done. You're yeah. not in the picture already. Uh. Yeah, sometimes they even. Uh, they can be quite extreme. Mm-hmm. They can uh, steal all those uh, fetus and everything. Oh, yeah, I've heard about yeah. that. Those, uh, those stories also, like, where the people steal the fetus. Yeah. And uh, they use uh, witchcraft to like, control them. Yeah. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah, so they are actually forcing them do things, and it's actually very, very. Yeah. It's like the spirit being uh, jerked by the uh, master and being controlled. Basically, you got so kidnapped true. by yeah. the master, uh, Then from like going the normal like timeline, now you got kidnapped halfway. Then after that, you become like the master's puppet, uh, and in the way he control you already. Uh. Yeah. So you are. Uh, a pet for him. A pet for the person. <laughs> yeah, so that is actually not good. Yeah, la, true, true, true. And uh, for all these uh, awkward items, right? Mm. I should advise uh, you guys, right? Uh, if you really want to get into all this stuff, right? Mm? Make sure that uh, you know what you are doing. Yeah. yeah. So remember, guys, if you guys are into this type of stuff, right? And you're planning to get this type of stuff, right? Make sure you guys know what you guys are doing and at least no, it's coming from the right source. Correct? Yes. Yeah. And not those uh, black magic master. Yeah, true. Unless you yourself do black magic, then uh, that's a different story. Yeah. Really. <laughs> I think that's all uh, for today for this special seven month interview. The continuation part two. You can watch the part one. It will be in the link below in the description. And bye bye.